Hi guys, it's Harry here with Laser Know How. Today we're going to take a quick look at the Boxer series of laser. What I've got here is the 2.5 watt version. You've got the 4 watt version, the 8 watt version and the 16 watt version if you want to upgrade the powers in those. So taking a quick look round the unit, side on, fans here and mounting brackets and then we come to the back of the unit which is where all the ins and outs are. So if we look in the top corner you've got the LCD monitor. All that's doing is taking the features that used to be controlled by dip switches on older lasers and giving you a visual readout of what you're doing. So with the mode button here, it allows you to cycle between the different features the laser's got. So we've got DMX in and out, that's your standard lighting control, you can control it through a Grand MA or whatever lighting console you've got. You've also got ILDA in and out, which allows you to take the functionality of this laser and really exploit it. If you're going to get something like Quick Show or Phoenix or one of the laser show designers, what it allows you to do, straight from the computer into the back of the laser and you've got your laser shows on there. Up above there we've got the safety features, really important when you're working with lasers so you've got the safety features. Key lock on and off and the remote interlock as well so no one's going to be messing around with this if you take those with you. You've also got power con in and out there which is brilliant for daisy chaining. So let's say you bought two or three of these units, you've got them on stage and you want to just go into the first one, ILDA and power out of that one, into the middle one and along further so it makes setup so much easier. If we go up from there, you've got an SD card slot. Again, something which for a laser at this price point and this size is great to have built in. What you can do is you can save laser shows or save laser show files onto that SD card, put it in the back of the laser, hook it up with DMX to your normal lighting console, and you can trigger the shows or the graphics files over DMX. So let's say you've got something like a wedding if you're a mobile DJ. You want to have the bride and groom's name projected save that onto the SD card and trigger it over DMX with the rest of your lighting rig. No faffing about with computer control, just over DMX. And we've also got X and Y invert. So again, going back to that wedding scenario, let's say you project it onto a wall, but it's backwards. Flick the X switch and you've inverted that and it becomes the right way around. It's also perfect when you've got two lasers side by side and they're running on the same run of cable. Make them scan together by inverting that X axis. So so useful to have that built in. Safety scan switch as well, if you go below a certain scan speed, the laser is going to shut off perfect for safety. You've also got sound active, that's another mode you can select, and you've got the zoom size as well. So if you're working in a very large room but you want it to project onto the back wall, change your zoom size on there and it's going to adjust the speed. So I think that's everything we've got on the back. Obviously two safety chain hooks as well, so if you're going to height mount it, I think that's about everything. Let's take a look at the front. So behind this panel here, you've got all your alignment controls, that's just done with an Allen key. So that panel just unscrews and you can align your laser. We've also got the laser aperture protector down here, so if we slide that down, inside here we've got the scanning mirrors. The scanning mirrors with the Boxer series, you've got 30k or you can take it up to 40k scan speed as well. 40k is brilliant if you're going to be doing high quality graphics that have got a lot of text or a lot of lines drawn on the screen at once. So yeah, that's the Boxer series. Again, 2.5 watt, 4 watt, 8 watt, 16 watt, 30k scanners, or 40k scanners. Check out laserknowhow.co.uk for more details.